why do atoms get bigger as you go down a group on the periodic table? The answer simply is that there are more shells of electrons that are filled, and each shell is further from the nucleus, i.e. farther out, larger radius than the one before it. If you go down column one or group one, you get helium, lithium, sodium, potassium, rubidium, cesium, and the radioactive francium that you can never get your hands on. Hydrogen only has one electron total and it is in the first shell. So if you have the nucleus, which only takes up like 0 0.1, 0.01 percent of the whole volume of an atom, then you have one electron in that first shell. It's, I don't know, one shell wide of an atom. By the time you get to lithium, which has three electrons, you're only allowed to put two electrons in that first shell. So the third electron needs to be in the second shell. It is automatically a larger atom. Now, technically, because lithium has three protons, each of these shells are held a little bit closer than they are in the atom above it. Put another way, the first shell of lithium is smaller than the first shell of hydrogen because there are three protons and the electrons in that shell are held closer. But you're filling or adding electrons to an entirely different shell, which is automatically further out than the outer shell of the one in the row above it. Get down to sodium, which needs 11 electrons. You can put two in the first orbit or shell, eight in the next one, but then you need a third shell to accommodate that 11th electron. And even though these two inner shells are held closer than they were here or there, there's a third shell occupied, so the atom is larger. More shells mean bigger atoms. That's all there is to it. Best of luck to you.